Hey guys, what's up? It's once again mp4podcast.com. I previously played Gunman Clive on iOS and I absolutely loved it. And I'm super, super happy that it's on the Amazon Kindle. Just to let you know, Amazon Kindle is Android. Uh, so you can take this as an Android review or a, also as a Kindle review. It's the same exact game. Uh, before, before I play it, I want to go into the options. As you can see, the sound, you can change the uh, volume of the music and the sound effects. Controls, you can actually uh, customize the size of the D-pad and the jump and shoot button. Uh, the keys, you can change the keys around a little bit if you want to um, change the jump button and the shoot button. That's the only buttons I would probably want to change anyway. If you know some people like to change that around, um, you can change the uh, screen size. Um, you can ch change the rendering mode: a low, medium, and high. Low looks a little bit more paperish, where medium and high look a little bit more like a cartoon on paper. And you can check uh, check off flickering if you want. So anyway, let's go and start a game. And here we go. Now the graphics in this game are absolutely beautiful. I kind of feel if this was a game that came out for the Sega Genesis or the Super Nintendo or one of those great 16-bit systems, this would probably be one of the top 10 games that we would still be talking about 20 years later. And I've always, always loved the uh, cowboy sci-fi um, atmosphere really. And I love the old cartoon Galaxy Rangers uh, in case you guys are familiar with Galaxy Rangers and uh, Brave Star. And there actually is a cowboy sci-fi movie that was on Netflix. I guess it was kind of popular back in the 90s or 80s. Outlander, I can't remember the, the name of it, but it's, it has a similar name to probably something else that's popular. Duck Down, Rapid Fire, and that's how you take that guy out. Here I can pick up my spray gun. Take him out. I want to get this guy right. And took care of both of those guys pretty easily. Now here comes a wolf. You know. You just have to really remember the pattern. There's going to be a bad guy right over here. Well, he was over there. I shot him. Oops, there he was. And there I didn't make the jump. Um, it's just a little hard sometimes playing over a camcorder. I'll try it a couple more times. And I'll try to run through this as fast as I can. And I know there's going to be two bullets right over here. And get the cake right over here. Take his ass out. So now you're going to jump up and duck, wait until he shoots the second bullet and just spray fire. And usually that does work. <laughs> Didn't work right there, but it worked previously. So here we get the um, spray gun. Take him out. Get the cake. Now that wolf is going to show up again right over here. So let's take out this bad guy right over here. So here we go. And I took his ass out. 
Now you're gonna get these guys that pop up underneath the floor. Um, they're pretty easy to take out, so. They just add a lot of different things in this game that just keep you on your toes, really. And here we, since I don't have the, if I had the spray gun, I could shoot him diagonally and take out this guy. But if, if I don't, I gotta time it. And then I'll get a spray gun over here. Sometimes that spray gun will show up, sometimes it won't. I don't know why, but some, I guess it's random. So that also adds a little bit more to the gameplay because you don't really know when you're going to be rewarded. Oh, I thought there was a spray gun. Is this, can I go back there? No. Alright, so we're going to jump on this box, jump over here, guy's going to pop out, make sure I get this on camera right, on the floor. You want to wait until this guy shoots two bullets, duck down, shoot him, take him out. Easy as cake. Maybe that's why these cowboys eat lots of cakes. Now here it can be a little tricky trying to get on that ladder. Um, I usually have a little bit of a problem doing this. You kind of want to jump right where that hole is, so. Alright, here we go. Stage clear. Now, I'm going to try and get to the end of the boss, um, but I'm not sure if I'll be able to do it. I'll give it a, a few tries. And I really love this platforming, how it has this back and go stuff. And there I died. And if you can go, you can go back and forth on these things. And this gun right here is it's a tracking gun. And I took them out pretty easily. And again, if I die, I have to do this at the all the way at the beginning. So here we go. I want to make sure I line this up with the alright, he's gonna go down. Oh, all right. Try this one more time. Oh, I didn't lose my gun. Alright, my super weapon of mass destruction. Oh, I did lose it. What am I talking about? Yeah, alright, so let's give it a couple more whirls.
spray gun. All right, so here we go. Ah, it went over too far. See how much more time. I'd probably just try one more time, see how far I can get, get over here. Alright, I'm going to stop the game right over here. Um, This is a great game guys, um, it's a little hard to play when I'm having my arms stretch out over a table with a big giant pole in front of me while I'm playing this game. But this is a great game, I made it to the boss on the iPad and on the uh, iPod Touch. I'll leave those links also if you just want to see a little bit more uh, of me playing the game or so. Um, this is a great game, I'm just so happy that like th a game like this came out because I really do do like it. Um, all I can say is buy it, you're going to love it. Um, also, um, I'll leave all the other links um, that I talked about. Um, Galaxy Rangers, if it's on Hulu. Uh, Brave Star, I think that's on Hulu. Uh, those cartoons may be on Netflix as well. And that cowboy uh, sci-fi movie, I'll try to find um, that as well. But if anybody else knows of any other sci-fi cowboy stuff, and I don't like uh, Cowboys and Aliens. I actually read the comic book to that. But that was actually kind of crappy. One of the worst comic books I ever read. Um, but there is another uh, Cowboys and Aliens that was made for, that was on Vimeo. I think it was a college um, short film. And I'll leave a link to that as well. Um, if you guys want to check that out as well. It has nothing to do with the, with the, Holly, with the Hollywood version. This one was actually made way before the Hollywood version, a couple of years before. But anyway, um, if you really enjoyed this video, please subscribe to the channel. More Kindle Fire app reviews to come. Take care, everyone. Bye.